Thousands of youths from all the counties in the western region converged in Kakamega for a BBI sensitization and economic empowerment conference. The function which was held at Masinde Muliro University of Science and Technology was the second in the country. The first event was held in Nairobi to prepare the youth and sensitize them on why they should support BBI during the next year's referendum. We need to trade with the government, but again, we don't need youths who are just crying because they don't have information on what is supposed to be done. So as women in business and our partners, we are keen to instill this skill development into our youths. We want to see women and youth from central Kenya trading with those of Kakamega comfortably that there's no double taxation, yes. that there is enough uh, and good policy that is allowing them that if you're in the transport business, you don't need to be taxed at every county level. The problem with this country is that uh, we have a big bulge of youth who are always, um, most of the time, unemployed and um, available, very much available for misuse. Uh, by crooked politicians, available for recruitment into extremism and stuff like that. And that's why uh, our theory of change as the Global Peace Foundation is to be able to empower the youth, empower the women, so that when you have food on your table, then nobody will be able to misuse you.